Yo, what up? How you doing today? Chad Lannis. We're going to continue on Mirror's Edge. Uh, the playthrough. Right now we're at Prisoner X where we have to get to the view. Over this beautiful new purple area that we've unlocked. And uh, let's get to it. Isabel Kruger confirmed that Noah is alive. Yeah, no crap. Freaking called it. Semi-sentient defense systems. The works. They even have anti-air systems in place. I mean, who would attempt an airstrike against Krugersek? Okay. Awesome. Anyway, but you still don't have uh, any information uh, regarding where he's being held. Word for word, I'm reading it correctly. <laughs> and the information is only available at Krugersek HQ, aka the dogs. Plastic has promised to help you get inside, but a solution might not be an easy one. Uh, this is where we're going to go to that really fancy looking tower out in the middle of the water, probably. And that actually might mean this is maybe the end of the game. Plastic, I'm at the waypoint. Okay. So I gotta get onto a VTOL, which is like the I think the flying ships. Get ready, Faith. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, I'm ready. It's there. You need to catch it before they leave. Follow it, and then use the mag to attach to it when they stop to hover. So yeah, we gotta get on that ship thing. Idiots, dude. Idiots. I can't see it. Should I stop for that thing? <laughs> I gotta get on that? Alright. Yo, working on it. Oh god, where am I going? Oh, thank god. Okay, good. I was like, I'm running out of walkway here. I don't think I'm gonna make it. But you know what? We in there. Uh, I think I might want to stop those X things. It's not like I have to ch catch a plane or anything. I don't have to, don't have to like outrun a freaking helicopter or anything. I grab that. Well, that didn't take long. Cool. Yeah, I don't know um, what that recording was, but you know, earlier when I was playing this game, I picked up a recording and completely screwed up all audio. I really hope that didn't happen right here. That was a definitely like a problematic game bug earlier. Hopefully that doesn't happen. That would definitely suck. Woo, we in there. We in there, dog. Go hold it. Yep, and you know, I also fall to your death. Yeah, because nobody lives in this residence area, okay, as I pointed out last episode. At the landing pad, of course. Then make your way through the maintenance tunnels to the big dock where their service stacks are. Fancy purple residence areas and stuff, nobody around, not a single person. I think I actually saw one person right before I jumped off there. So that one person maybe owns everything. Wait, did I bring a VTOL to construction? You have to get off. What the hell? I can't let go here. No, don't kill yourself. That would be stupid. I mean, get off when they pass by the building. Uh, this building? Wait, get off now! Jump! I'm pushing buttons. Nothing's happening. There we go. Okay, well, I've I'm held L2. But... I think. Sorry about that. I override didn't work. Sorry. You have to make Shots. your way over to the big dog. So am I here now, or is it that building over there? I have no idea. Uh, where am I going over there? You yeah, know, nope, over here. <laughs> totally knew it. Complete opposite direction. I was just uh, doing snake eyes, dude. Snake eyes. Snake eyes. Oh. Find a way to build like this. Like this. Okay. Main servers got it. I don't think this is that big building. I don't think it's the building in the middle of everything. Oh, I heard a secret thing. It's up there. 
Uh, maybe I run this. Oh crap, okay, I can get that for sure. I can easily get that. Yo, hold on, all right. I know I talk a lot about stuff. Easy, dude. Yo, free XP, my dog. My dog, my dog, my dude, my dude. Yo, we in there. Awesome. It's pretty much every time you see that symbol and you hear that sound, you'll need to find the thing with the stuff. And the hoot nanny. The hoot nanny. You haven't heard about the hoot nanny before? Well, let me tell you all about it some other time. Drop them down. Hey, yo. We in there. Yo, slide right down in them DMs, girl. Uh, where are we going? Right. Uh, this is pretty cool. You jump on that. All right. Yo, uh, this is going to take forever. I can make that jump. Guess so. All right, we got this. We got this. Um. Oh, just conveniently, the elevator is going down the exact moment I jump onto the bottom part of it. I mean, I guess you can argue that plastic did it. But the fact that she hasn't said anything about it, we didn't communicate anything. Plus, we don't really like actually know that she can completely track my whereabouts. Really? Jump on it. Jump on it. Uh, 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 uh. Climb to the bottom. There you go. Jump on it. There you go. Wait, am I going that way? Yep. Oh god, oh god, oh god, no! Why would you jump towards like random pipes that you can't grab specifically, even though you've already proven that you can pretty much grab onto pipes in a general sense of many different shapes and sizes? But those specific pipes, you can't grab onto them. Um, with that said, what? Did I not just like get in grabbing range? Can you not like extend your arms past this distance, Faith? Not only can you not grab pipes suddenly that aren't glowing red magically in your vision, because apparently you can only see red and white and like odd grays, but not that shade of black. Uh, you also can't extend your arms past half distance. Line up perfectly and take like five years to do this. All right, there we go. Perfect, yeah. There we go. Cool. All right, climb down. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Um, can we just talk about finger strength real quick? All right, cool. We talked about it briefly. What we talked about? It. Yo, jump it. There we go. I do, and it would be a tremendous addition if we didn't have to rely on visuals alone. I'll talk to Director Thor tomorrow. What are you doing? Take a dump on them. Nothing planned. Why? I'm not cycling to offsite this next week. I was thinking maybe you'd like a drink. Or just coffee or whatever. Are you asking me out? Is she asking him out? I guess I am. He didn't answer her! How awkward it is to be right now! To be in that elevator! They're just standing there. They didn't have any sounds of them walking away. So she just said, I guess I am. And then without them like him answering while they're fading away out of distance of ears reach, he just didn't answer. So either the he legit ignored the question at this point, or he took like 30 seconds plus to answer for sure. Alright, I would retract my question of if you want to go get some coffee or drink later. Because that guy is a complete jerk. Probably need to go this way. Yo, you at least give her the respect of a no. The bottom of the elevator shaft. What next? Let's check. Yeah, you're close to the umbilical. Make your way through maintenance to the outside, and then cross there. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, but yeah. Probably should have jumped here. Uh, even if you're like some like spineless scumbag, you'd at least say, uh, let me think about it and see if my schedule's open, and then just never get back to her. Just get out of that situation. Can I climb up these? Okay, uh, what are you holding on to at this point? What are you, um, uh, okay. Cool. 
That's exactly how I'm supposed to do that. It looked a little fishy, but I'll take it. Oh, I did not see that pipe there. And I was like, I'm just going to do it. Ray told me to do it. I'm the first ever to break into the dogs. All right. Yeah, let's hope I can. Hello. Let's go this way. <gasps> Pound it. What happened to your family? They're in the Greylands. Why? With them. I can't stand my sister. She's an idiot. Do you have a sister? No. Bad question. Once you get through the fan system, maybe the main service stack. That's the heart of Kruger Sec in glass. I wish I could be there. Unless Isabel Kruger is my sister. I don't know if you really want to be here. Uh, you just not mentioned how I might die. A terrible, terrible death. Considering the fact that nobody's ever broken into here before and made out alive or anything. Can't disrupt it. Yo, let's go. I don't even know if I'm the one who did it. You should connect to one of the priority switches. Then I can take it from there. there. Looks like freaking space, the final frontier up in here. Look how cool that looks. How cool that looks. I did not take the time to properly appreciate this area. Can I go back? I don't think I can. Um, it's worth it. It's worth possibly dying. You know what? This is worth possibly dying. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get a better view of this location. And I want us to be able to get a good view of how cool this looks. Because just looking at one wall is like dope. I didn't really like look around. Um, to be not like that huge scenery and stuff. But like my god, look at that. Look how cool this looks! I'm probably gonna be up in this business for a while, so I didn't really need to kill myself there. But at least now we're getting this out of the way, and then I can just move on to just completely free running. But look how cool this looks, dude! This is dope. This is really dope looking. Um, mad expensive, dope looking. All right, let's get this going. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. On to the pipe. I can somehow just stand on magically. Cool. Oh, thank God I made that jump. Let's go. We in there. Surface stack is a maze. Yeah, well, it wasn't designed with humans in mind. Pure machine space. Pure function. I bet it's beautiful. Couldn't tell if she said amaze isn't like it's actual like maze, or if she was just saying it's short for amazing. Because both definitely apply to the situation. Also, right. you should note that when you connect me, we will be noticed. I can delay the security routine a little, but it's impossible to avoid detection completely. I've asked you okay. to describe the room, but I guess you're busy. Are you busy? No, sorry. Forget I asked. I'm sure you are not very busy, busy at all. you're not saying anything. He comes up high, by the way. He seems to like you. And he doesn't like anyone. There's something wrong with his emotional response algorithm, but I can't find the error. Is she a nervous talker? Seems like nervous talker. Alright. We got to the red pipe. We in there. We in there. Oh, did I jump that way? Definitely seems like I jumped that way. Alright, 100% wrong. I have to start running. But uh, let's book you on down. All right, I'm there. Here we go. Connecting to a priority switch now. Oh, you're now. there. We in there, dude. We Stop. in there. Dude. In. Be ready to get out fast. Always am. Okay. I have access. Wow. Let me see. Prisoner data. There. Got it. And there. We're noticed. Get out. Wait. One more thing. Grab anything you can find about Isabel Kruger. Searching. And there. Done. She's your sister. Now get out. I'll start the decryption. I Where am I going? Alarm, but it'll go off in a few minutes. Fastest way out is to ride the employee shuttle leaving from the main lobby. Thank you. Um, can I reiterate? This definitely looks really cool. Um... 
God, dude. That scared me, actually. Like, actually scared. Yo, we in there, we in there. Over there. My man, just a regular employee. Going this way. Here we go. Uh, was that the route? I think this is it. Oh, okay. Oops. Ow, I didn't know I needed a roll. I didn't know it was that far. I'm at the Jeez. lobby. The train's just leaving. We'll have to wait for the next one. Okay. Alright, you're on full alert. I hope you make it. Um, I'm actually really curious if this strategy works. Like I hear them like clocking or like clopping around or whatever you want to call it, like clunk, clunk, clunking, clunking around. I hear them clunking around. So like it's like they're trying to find me. I wonder who's out there at this point. You know, like uh, I've been doing cuts at this. I'm I'm sure. I just heard like a shock trooper or something just shooting at something. I'm sure in post I'm going to be cutting this. I'm not going to have you guys just sit around. Um, but I've been waiting here for like three minutes. I don't know if they are constantly going to like spawn more guys. Like assuming I've been taking them out at a rigorous pace. Um, or if it's just sitting on like the standard like three or four dudes out there or something, you know? And I'm really curious. The reason why I'm doing this, I'm really curious if they like had such a bad design flaw to where you can legit just sit here for like five minutes and then just get on a train. So we'll give it another two minutes probably. I don't really see I don't really think the timer would be longer than five minutes. Who's really gonna be fighting people for five minutes, right? Um I'm curious. Oh god, it's been hours. Oh god. okay, let's fuck. Let's see what's happening. Oh um, okay. Um Control, we have an intruder. Sup! How you doing? Yo, sup? Oh, he just got launched! Okay, uh, what's going on here? Where am I going? What am I doing? Who was happening? Who did it? Oh god. Free light attacks! Free light attacks! Wait, is that, are those real All right. Yo, can I just kick you off the thing? Sweet, I can kick you off the thing. Can I kick you off the thing? Uh, well, apparently that killed you. I don't know how leaning onto a bench is uh, deadly, but all right. Whoa, whoa, it's a sentinel guy. Whoa. Uh, hi. Bop. Get. Oh God. Free light attacks. 
What? They get wrecked. Oh god. Get on it, I'll make sure he gets out of there. Get wrecked, Sentinel! Uh, where I gotta go, where I gotta go, where I gotta go? Uh, hello? Get on the train? Did I die? I think I killed myself. But that was like a regular floor. That's not too far. I think I had to jump and launch onto the train or something. I think, I think it, like the game is like, you're not allowed to touch the floor. Are you serious? I could do all of that again. Whoa, game. Whoa, game. All right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run around in circles to build up my disrupt. We got stage two for disrupts now. Oh, we gotta fight them all again. That's stupid. That's actually kind of stupid. Alright. I'm at the lobby. Oh, we're just Kill them. They actually killed them. They get knocked into each other like idiots. Idiots. Easiest fight of my life. Easiest fight of my life, dude. Easiest fun in my life, dude. You're gonna die in one shot. Alright, bring on Sentinel. Run down, all right. That's what I'm gonna do this time. I'm just gonna run down. Instead of jump. Oh, there's a gate. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just do this way. And they can't just jump from here this time. All right, we in there. We in there. Oh, cause there's giant glass walls there, and you're caught off. Okay, I see how that would be like. You're not I'll pull the train down so you can get off. All right. Yeah. Thank you, plastic. Uh, I got the hang of fighting in this game now, so fighting sequences like that are like. I might have a way to find out. Okay, I'll check up on Isabel Kruger next. Thanks, Plastic. Talk yeah. soon. She's your sister. I'm just saying, she's your sister. Um, we did it. Yo, we probably loved up. But yeah, I lived with two bars left. And I even kind of turned my brain off for part of that fight sequence and not even close to threatened. So I kind of just straight up just fought them without doing like movement patterns or like using my disrupts or anything. Um, so easy stuff, easy stuff. Easy stuff. Are right, we got an upgrade? Uh, what do we want to upgrade? Slide stuff? Nah, I, mean, I think, um, I think, um, We can go with heavy transversal damage. Start it off like pretty strong, you know, get some one shots in. I think that'd be pretty great. I gotta probably like figure out how to do that. Uh, get to higher ground would be definitely the thing there. Um, do I want that? Can't get anything in gear. As long as slide, I don't really care that much about it. More focus shield at the start isn't really that big a deal. I'm very rarely at max focus shield for anything anyway. So who really cares? Let's go heavy transversal damage. I'm at the point where I really could care less about upgrades for the most part. To be honest. 
to be honest. All right, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Right there? Okay. Okay, dude. Wait. What is this? Ask Dogen about Kingdom. We can do that. We can definitely do that. How do we get out of here? Up here? Yo, Ray, you want to tell me to go up this ladder or are we going over here? Well, what was that line? Did I just tell me to go through the roof? It is. Okay, I'm probably going to take this ladder. I think Ray just told me to go actually through physical objects. Bruh, I know you just like a light structure that just kind of like pulsates, but like... I don't think it really works that way, my dude. I really don't. I'm pretty sure, um... I'm not the flash. I can't like split my atoms by moving rapidly and just phase through objects, dude. Can't do that. You know, Shadows of DC Comics, my favorite superhero in the world. Fun fact. Chad facts, Chad Lance facts. So it was really weird to me that, um, I couldn't just wait for the... They said, try to stay alive long enough for, um, try to stay alive long enough for the next chain arrive. With the fighting sequence thing happening, I finished the fight sequence in three minutes. I waited for like hours and it never showed up. Um, real time. So that's stupid. I kind of, I kind of don't like that. That's just me. That's just me. I, I think that's just lazy scripting. Maybe if they say, like, try to stay alive long enough. I don't want to do your thing. I don't care about level up anymore, so I really care less. Um. Crap! I jumped that wrong. I think it's just lazy scripting, because if they just said, try to stay alive long enough until the train uh, survive, or arrives, or try to fight off the Kruger sec until the train arrives, or something that like tells you to do that, you know? Um, otherwise, why would it go under that and just run around it? Wasted energy. Um, like energy matters. Faith has like infinite energy, that's her superpower. Unlimited stamina. Um, oh, I just entered a new area. I was like, why are things popping on my screen? But yeah, something that would like imply like, strongly suggesting your character to do this thing. Otherwise, if the only thing I was told to your character was chill until it survives and then jump on it, then I would think that Faith would actually just chill there until it would like arrive and then jump on it, you know? Faith isn't going to be like, you know what? Screw everything. We're going to fight these guys. <laughs> Me, it's like really skinny teenage girl. I'm going to fight all these dudes because I'm bored waiting. Let's talk to Dogen. Get out of my sight before I cut you up for stew. Faith. I'm not in the mood. That Do you have the blueprint? No. And I need a favor. And a new home, from what I hear. Huh. Do you also find it mystifying that I keep on giving and get nothing in return? Please. I need to find a facility called Kingdom. Noah's being held there. Kingdom. The conglomerate's dirty little secret. Ooh. Do you know where it is? <laughs> I I'll run for you. Five years, no questions asked. Five years? Ten years. Twenty. Holy crap. You won't live that long. Holy crap. A second time. Like to his state. Go to rezoning. And dig your way down. That's where you'll find kingdom. What? For free? Thank you. Is he like my father figure? Faith! Faith, are you there? Plastic? Finally! Guess what? Isabel Kruger is not Gabriel Kruger's biological daughter. He adopted her. Her real name is Caitlin Connors. Isn't your name Connors too? What if? It is. I have to talk to her. But I thought your sister was... Oh. Sorry. So Isabel Kruger is your sister, Faith? The plot thickens. I've sent you the approximate location of Kingdom. Who are you? Who are you? I'm Plastic. Faith's friend. I didn't think Faith had any friends. She does too. Faith, I'll compare that location with the city's plans. Should have something for you when you talk to Isabel. I mean, Caitlin. You have access to the full city plans. We should do business sometime. 
Your debt is growing big. Make sure you're around to repay it. I'm off. I freaking called it! Man. Alright. I kind of like that. But freaking called it! Also, is Dogen like my, my third father? Because Noah is kind of like my second father. But now Dogen's acting like my third father. And I'm so confused about exactly who my father is in this game. Like, is it my the, the dead dad? Or is it like my adopted kind of father? Or is it like the crime boss a watchful guardian father? Like, what is happening? Exactly. Like, <laughs> I have like three dads. Um while residing within the most like predictable plot line ever i like how they try like the script writers try boasting their own like scripting like yeah we did a good job nobody would ever see that isabel krueger a character looks just like faith and is about the same age and mysteriously appears every out of nowhere when they were shoving down your throat that the flashbacks they deeply involve your sister who's younger and then like maybe it died but we didn't confirm if she died or not but with that all I like, provided as information for the gamer they'll never figure out that she's like actually probably her sister look how good of storytellers we are we're gonna have this character Dogen say ah oh, the plot thickens when we drop this bomb on them that's what we're gonna do we're gonna drop a bomb on them and say the plot thickens with one of our own characters that's the play. I didn't think that was far enough for a drop. But yo, like honestly though, where am I going? All right. Yo, I am not. Whoa. I almost, in my like hubris, just ran through all of this. I'm going to just do that. <laughs> Wait, is this underground, like Rebecca's lair? I can actually trash travel to her lair. Even faster. Uh, who am I going to, by the way? I think I have to go underground Rebecca's place. Hold on. Yeah. 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 So, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> fast travel to Rebecca's place is even faster. I did this before, but you know what? Whatever. Alright, so we gotta go talk to Kat. Who's our sister? Who we honestly always knew was our sister. And by the way, Noah is not dead. Who we always knew was not dead. And then Icarus, who's a scumbag, totally not a scumbag. Rebecca, who seemed like somebody we like might actually want to side with, totally a joke, and we don't want to side with her. Um, might be related to plastic. I'm gonna go ahead and just throw out every like predictable like possibility. All right, plastic and her and Rebecca look kind of similar. Um. That's not racist either. Like they have like the same lip and like jaw structure and everything. Um so ages are there. Plastic's family just lives out in the Grey Lands and she's like ignore that they exist anymore. Maybe that's the thing. I'm just really using the right trigger to travel for now. Uh anyway, we're gonna go ahead and talk to my sister, who we always knew was our sister, but we didn't know who she was my sister. Um in the next episode hopefully you enjoyed this episode i'm sorry i apparently spoiled it all for you but i legit in all honesty didn't look into any spoilers for this game and my god is it predictable i love your faces thank you so much for watching thank you so much for being you citizens see you in the next episode